Hi guys and welcome back to our channel. If you're new around here, we have literally just picked up the keys to our new house. So this is our house tour. Come look around our new house with us. Before we go any further, I'm just gonna say this was filmed literally within the two minute window of getting the keys and then having to unload the van. So bear with, but it gives you an insight into what it looks like before we moved in. So this is our hallway lit. I've just popped Tommy down in here. And straight in to our kitchen dining. We've got some stuff down there from B&M. This is our kitchen diner. We've got a built-in fridge freezer here. We've got some bits from our moving in presents. Look, I like this. This is the uh, magnetic knives. Loving a bit of this sink. So much nicer than our old one. And all the kitchen cupboards. What do you think, Tommy? What do you think? Do you like it? Really like the flooring in here too. Then we've got a cupboard under the stairs. I think we're gonna take the door off this and that'll actually end up being a little room for Buddy. I think long term we'll plaster it and make it look pretty, but for now we'll just take the door off. Then we've got, oh, downstairs bathroom or toilet room, whatever you'd like to call it, just in there, which is so handy with the kids. Then we have got the lounge. So this is our new lounge. It's all got carpet in it. It's like a dark, creamy, beigey carpet. And then we've got the garden. We've got quite a big patio area round here. We've got decking right at the bottom, some lavender bushes, a nice clothes line. And then down here is the passage through to the front. I think long term in our lounge, we're gonna keep it quite light and airy. We're planning to do, what do you think? We do need to get some curtains for the French doors, but we've also ordered some sofas before we move. They're coming end of November. So we've got the old sofa coming into there for now in the kitchen. I don't think we're gonna do much decorating there to start off with. Our main priority is gonna be the lounge and we've got a seat. So then we have got the stairs up until the second floor. This is the smallest bedroom. This is what we're actually gonna turn into Tom's gaming room. It's a good little size for him and all of his space. I think he might be putting his desk there and then he can store all of his boy toy stuff in this room. What do you think? What do you think? You got hiccups. We've then got this will be the girls room in here. So they'll have their big bunk bed up against that side. It's a good size double bedroom. So they'll be next to Tom's gaming room. I don't know what I'm gonna decorate that one like. Then we've got the family bathroom here. I just wanna say, I love the fact that this bath actually has a headrest here and a twisty plug mechanism. That's one of my favorite points of this room. I would like it. Oh, your towel radiator. I like that it's got a window. Oh, and it's got this built-in cabinet there. Oh, but I really like the sink in here. I like all the tiles. Oh, and then round here, we've got what will be Tommy's bedroom. It's got some shelves left in here. I like the color on the walls in here. It's nice and neutral. The whole house, to be fair, is so neutral. I'm liking the idea of Tommy's bedroom doing like a woodlands kind of theme or a jungle theme or like an animal theme or like safari. Are you, are you about that too? Is this your bedroom? Yeah, the girls have decided in this house that they still want to share. Not the earring, not the earring, no. We have actually now got a full bed, but the girls have decided they still want to share a room. So for now, Tom will have the smallest room as a little gaming room full of his stuff. And I think possibly long-term, we're gonna try build a conservatory on the back that when the girls want their own room, that's where all the gaming and everyone's fun stuff will go. 
So then we have mine and Tom's room. I have the biggest, biggest confession to make. Oh my goodness. So at some point I either didn't press play for the bedroom tour or I have deleted it off my camera in the madness of moving. The biggest of apologies. I'm howling with laughter though because I've even debated taking all the furniture out of our bedroom just to get the clip again. However, with three kids, that commitment could not be made. So you'll have to use a bit of an imagination in these next few clips to judge the space of our new bedroom, but it is quite big. We've got the loft up there. Long term, we want to change the lighting in the bedroom. Not quite sure what to just yet. And here in our bedroom is actually quite a really big space. I'm not sure what we're gonna do with it. Long term. And then in here, we have the ensuite. Again, I really like this flooring. A nice toilet, sink, and a shower as well. And a nice window. And then outside we actually have a double garage next to our house as well. So this is so exciting, walking around the new house. Tom is outside starting to unload all the van. So I'm gonna go and help because I can't dodge responsibilities much longer and we're gonna get some lunch with us. But I hope you like what you saw today. If you did, please make sure that you subscribe. Come join our channel on our journey for lots of moving vlogs. If you haven't seen already, our moving vlog is up on the channel. I love you all. I hope to see you all soon. Bye.